Hello everyone, my name is Hanzu, welcome to the newest Witch's Legacy game. This is Dark Throne. Yeah. Okay, before we start, I have to turn up the voices volume as usual. <laughs> yeah, the voices tend to run very, very low in the Witch's Legacy games. I don't know why, but here we go, let's start the game. Lynn established the Tom Charles Museum of Magic in honor of her brother's life and work. Your brother would be flattered beyond belief, Lynn. It's a fitting way to honor his legacy and sacrifice. Edward, look at this stained glass. Oh, please don't touch it. No, not again. <laughs> Oh, there's him. So, talk to Carrie. What's up? What's this? Edward, let's follow Lynn. Okay, come on, Im. Can I help him down? I have to bust the skeleton's hole on the Im. But how? Okay, I don't think we can do anything here. Let's go inside the mirror then. Oh, that is our loyal Im. We've got to help him. Okay, what happened there? I thought we were going in. Whoa, it's now broken into pieces. So repair the stained glass, placing the shards into the right spots. Can I rotate the shards? Nope. Hmm, what is that? It's skull! With a third eye in the middle. Actually, not third eye, but only one eye. Hmm, and a circular object. What is that? Okay, the final piece. This portal to the other world will open once touched by the hand of a witch or with an object from the other world itself. An object from the other world. I'm not a witch, so we have to find an object then. Object from the other world. Tom Charlson's research room. So missing feather pen. Artifacts used for good and artifacts used in dark magic. Lean and Edward Watson opened the Tom Charlson Museum of Magic. Professor Tom Charlson was an expert in magic and myth. And he had quite a collection of arcane artifacts. Now, 15 years after his death, his sister is making these artifacts available to the public to view as part of the new Tom Charlson Museum of Magic, which opens this week. So, Tom Charlson and his sister Lynn. Hmm, all the pictures. Characters from the past games. Uh, okay, why am I doing this? Oh, I'm dividing them up! Oops! <laughs> so, artifacts used for good. Uh, that would be tarot cards? Okay, that looks like a poison bottle. Dark magic. This one is dark magic. This is good magic. Dark magic. Good magic. This one, black candle, is dark magic. <laughs> okay, this is good magic, I guess. Ancient knife. Whoa, place an object here and learn its owner's secret. So I'm placing them back? Or do I place... Oh, I have nothing to place right now, okay. We'll come back. Um, bust the skeleton, can I use a knife? No. Whoa, whoa! We have some magic paintings going on. And... Okay! <laughs> I froze a room with a crystal ball. Ritual hammer. Where is the witch? 
Huh? A puppet witch, perhaps. Okay, let's use our uh, ritual hammer on the skeleton. Yeah. Are you okay, Imp? Are you alright? Hmm. Got a tusk for me. I can carve something out of this tusk. Use the knife? What are we carving here? Whoa, I carved a feather pan! <laughs> I'm quite good at this. Bone pan. So... A rose emblem. Alright, let's go in this way. To Thomas's office. Whoa, whoa, what is going on? <laughs> I'm so sleepy. I can't resist anymore. Edward, save Lynn. Never mind about me. Hmm, it's I think like she got his sleeping. life sucked out. <laughs> I better find Lynn so she can remove the spell. Okay, puzzle piece. Hey, I didn't see any puzzle piece on the first screen. Where is the bonus puzzle piece here? I don't see it. Oh, right here. There we go. Two puzzle pieces out of 36. Moving object. I remember making paper mache from newspaper in art class. Okay. Uh, okay, what do I do? I don't know how to do this. Is it glue? Oh, candle? Instruction sheet here, so we place the mask. Uh, okay, we cut the newspaper in pieces, and then we combine them with glue. In pieces, I don't have any scissors. Carrie's bag. What she got here? Hmm, picture frames. Carrie is like a mother to Lynn, but they're only distant relatives. Carrie saved Lynn from an evil witch and took her in as her own. Morgana tried to pull Lynn to the dark side, but Lynn resisted. Hmm, so a very quick summary of all the previous games. As a member of the Witch Hunter's Order, I was told to capture Lynn, but it was her good heart and beauty that captured me instead. And then they fell in love and got married. <laughs> and now they open the museum together. Sunglasses. Oh, if only I had a brain. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What's up with that hand? <laughs> Someone is outside. Missing bone? I have a bone to pick with Morgana. <laughs> the woman everyone said was a witch turned out to not... Turned out to not to be. She gave me a sack of earth and told me it came from the other world. Oh, that is the other world object. Hey, witch figurine, I remember this one. <laughs> uh, microscope here. On top of the case. Now the wish figurine. We put that on the stand. Hmm. Lin's brother devoted his life to studying magic, but he never believed in it. If only he knew how much his sister would have to go through. Including the loss of an entire family. Mechanical brain. Lightning catcher. Hmm. The glass of truth shows a living being's true identity. Yes. Of course, aimed. Used to be a puppy. <laughs> That we all know. Hey, what you gonna do in there? Grab the light bulbs. 
Are you okay? Oh, you want sunglasses? Here you go. <laughs> that is too bright for him. Whoa! He got the moves. <laughs> hey, wh what is this? A lens? Whoa, yes, this glass not only lets you see the true nature of creatures, but it can also create the treasure things. So can I turn him back? <laughs> Ned, I don't think so. Puppy photo. The glass of truth. Alright, the bone. Put it back here. The other world soil. And there's symbols here inside the case. So we sprinkle the underworld soil onto the mirror, I guess. So can we go in now? Yes, to the other world. So exactly what happened in that scene, Lin, and the Black Knight? Is he God in the tree? Whoa. Only witches are allowed into the other world. And you're no witch. Soon we will crown our new queen. Wait, so Lin is going to become your new queen? But why her? Hmm, he's not evil at heart. I need to know who he used to be. Okay, what happened there? <laughs> the plants are magical. And this one is missing a mask. That's why we're making that paper mache mask. It's like a spaceship here. So we're planting something, planting a seed into the soil, and then we use a mask onto that vessel, the vehicle. So we pour water onto the plant and make it grow. Water inside the UFO thing. Okay, what is that? Oh, map. We have a map. Eyeballs. Ooh. <laughs> The shuffle? We need to find a seed. Yep, the pipes are connected to the vessel here. And it's going to pour water onto the plant. A shape of a powerful symbol. A circle, that is a powerful symbol. <laughs> a snake? And the puzzle piece right here under the tree. Morphing object. You know what? For the first time ever, we're not playing as the ant. In all the previous games, we play as Carrie the ant. But not this game. <laughs> we're now Edward. Hmm, we're experiencing something new. Okay, what do we do now? Um, the glass of truth candle. Wait, the glass of truth. Can I use this on the soldier here? Yes. Look at the purple aura. So, turn on the knob. You used to be... who? Who are you? The gatekeeper's glove. Well, he used to be human. That we know. An ordinary god before someone turned him into a baddie. So, how is Imp going to help us this time? Yes, I know Imp. Um... Okay, I don't understand you. <laughs> the aim needs a way to trip out my god. What? The best way to stop a giant is to trip him with something. Oh! Trip him? What can I use? <laughs> I don't know. Okay, let's go back to the showroom now. Back inside the museum. <laughs>